Hey there, how are you? Thank you so much for coming and watching this video. I'm excited to share that finally I have answered this question that I have I received so many times from different students and, and writers from all over the world. Finally, not only do I have an answer, I actually have a way to solve this problem, and that is what is writer's block and how on earth do I get rid of it, okay? Is that, is that not a thing that has been plaguing you for the longest time? So I wanna talk about what is writer's block, why it happens, who it happens to, and how on earth do we obliterate that thing once and for all? Are you with me? Awesome, let's get started. So, my name is Catherine Storing. I am an author, I am a coach, I am the author of a gazillion books. You can see some of my books in the back there. Uh, but I'm a writer. At the end of the day, I'm a writer, and just like you, I have experienced writer's block. Can I tell you I have experienced writer's block? Not pretty, not fun, no sir, not at all to the tune of having to wait 20 long years to finish my first book, which you can see almost falling off my wall right there, but that's my first baby. See how beautiful he is? Um, Dream Big, Seven Keys to Stepping into Your Calling. That was my first book and that just changed everything. But before that, I wasted, I don't wanna say wasted, but I know 20 years went by before I could write that book because I was stuck trying to write my big old book, my 300 plus books, and that was just too big for me. But I didn't know what the problem was. I thought I need to be more dedicated so I would spend more time, or I needed to read more books, so I would buy more books. Any excuse to buy more books, right? Am I right? Um, I would try uh, magazines, and I would try videos, and I tried basically everything to be able to figure out what the problem was and I didn't know until finally I learned what writer's block was. I could tell you so many fancy things, but writer's block is when you cannot write, literally, and not like physically, there's nothing wrong with your hands, there's nothing wrong with your, with your eyes or your device, you cannot write. You sit down, you try to do it, nothing comes out. Like zip zero, nada nothing comes out. There's nothing more frustrating when you are supposed to be writing, when you, run to, when you want to write and you stare at that monster of the blank screen, nothing. Blank page, nothing looking back at you. It is frustrating. So that is what writer's block is. You just can't write. You want to, you have every desire to, and you just can't do it. Now, who does that happen to? Anybody. It can be a, a brand new writer like me uh, about three years ago or um, established writers that I, I, I read the other day, one of my favorite writers, she was talking about how she struggled. She's working on a new novel and she struggled. And I was like, yes! Not that I was happy that she was struggling with that, but because I knew that I'm human, okay? That you are human. That's a great news for you too. You are human. You can struggle too because it's part of life. It's part of life. So now, why does it happen, right? I, I didn't know. Did you know? I didn't know. Nobody ever told me why it happens. And what I discovered in my research uh, is that there are 10 different types, 10 at least main top uh, types of writer's block. And I thought, oh my God, I, I thought that I knew that it probably would be one thing, right? One type of writer's block. I did not think it would be so many, but there are actually about 10 different types of writer's block. And I just wanna pull them up right here and see, and see if this make any sense to you at all. If you feel like, you know what, Catherine Storing? Yes, I struggled with that one. So let's, let's just go through them real quick. Um, number one, um, the words won't come out. Like, you know what you want to say, you try, you, you have your fingers ready, nothing. Nothing happens. If you ever experienced that, let me know because that's a, that's a pain in the, new, in the you know what. Um, you have no idea what to write about. Like, you know you want to be a writer, you have a desire, you read amazing books, they inspire you, they push you to do great, and then nothing. Nothing. Like, that word, you don't know what to, like, what's the story and what's the book about? Like, you don't know. Have you ever been there? Oh, it's so frustrating. Uh, what about when you know what to write, but you find yourself doing everything but? Like, you will clean out that, that messy drawer that's been there for years and nobody's ever touched it. That's the day when you're supposed to be writing and you know exactly what the project is. 
um, you decide to clean up that messy drawer or um, you call your doctor to make that appointment to get five shots in one day because <laughs> you don't know why am I doing everything but the thing that I say I love to do what's the deal right I've been there myself it's so frustrating um, this one this one this one met with me for a long time and as you can tell I have a little bit a little bit of an accent <laughs> so you can tell that English was not my first language it is now but it wasn't for the longest time so are you afraid of what others might say of your writing are you worried they're not gonna think that your writing is up to par and that you might use the wrong the word um, tense word tense verb tense and people might, will make fun of you right like even right now I stumble with my words is that gonna be an issue no no problem at all but how do you get over that how do you how do you make it through? That is a bit main one. Too tired. Are you ever too tired to write? And I wish I can raise both my legs too. <laughs> but I've been there when I'm too tired and then I end up taking a quick little nap and then three hours later, then I'm too rested, I'm too groggy and then no writing happens. So frustrating. How about when you start to write but you find yourself jumping from one topic to the next? You're excited. You just get your laptop fire up and you're just typing so fast and you're like, oh, that story was good. Oh my God. And then, she, then he said that. Oh, but I got to talk about my end. And then you're just going and it just feels like an erotic person wrote this, right? Like, like what was happening? Was somebody chasing you? Why are you jumping from place to place? Has that ever happened to you? I know exactly why and how to fix that. Um, you don't know why you can't write. Like, it's not any of the other ones. You're like, I want to write. I just have no idea why. Like, but the answer to that one, ooh, the answer to that one left me. It's a smart one. It's a deep one, but it's a simple one once you get it. You don't know. Really? Really? Hmm. We'll find out. Um... What about this one? This one, really, really, I'm excited about this one. Can't think of just the right word, just the right word to write. Have you ever been in that place where you're like, okay, you're writing, everything is going smoothly. You're like, oh, 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 oh what's that word? Mm, it's not that, yeah, it's close to that. Mm -mm, that's not it. Mm. What's that word again? Mm, I'm not sure. Mm, what's that? Ooh, and then you spend, and then you go to the, the uh, to your dictionary. You you pick up a thesaurus. Uh, the thesaurus. 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 That thing. That thing that helps you figure out what what different words to use. Right. Nothing. That doesn't help. And then you waste. I have wasted hours looking for the right word. Forget about pronouncing it the right way. <laughs> the right word to write and it never comes and then you get frustrated your time your window for writing is over and then you didn't complete the time that you wanted to complete there's a way to fix that there is a way my friend there is a way to fix that what about when you get stuck in the middle of the story you are flying through everything is coming out so great and then you're like what is my character what what happens to him what happens now what is he gonna do what does he say Ooh, that's a great uh, plot twist, but now what? Have this ever happened to you? Oh my God, it's so frustrating. So frustrating. So frustrating that you don't know what comes next. So all of those are types of um, writer's block. Have you ever experienced any of those? Maybe all of them. I have experienced all of them at some time or another, and I don't anymore which is so exciting. I'm sorry. Don't hate me. Please, please don't hate me. I know, but I don't anymore. I don't have to because now I know how to deal with all of those things. They are um, tricks, their answers or strategies that you can implement that would help you um, to not have to deal with writer's block anymore. And that's what I have. I'm so excited. I have written the writer's block learn the 10 quickest ways to obliterate it. Now that is a word if I ever heard one and that word came to me just like that. I love that word. It's so graphic, but that's what we want. We don't want to cuddle with it. We don't want to call it our sweetheart. We want to obliterate it. We're going to inaliate it. We're just going to get rid of it once and for all. That's what I want for you. This ebook 
it's, 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 a, it's a labor of love for me, a labor of passion, and it comes from a place of pain. So if you ever experience pain and you don't want to deal with writer's block anymore, this ebook is for you. I also put together the audio version because, hello, you'll love this accent. You'll love to see me get, at least hear me get animated. I put the audio book together in case you don't want to read. I also have the video version because listen, who doesn't want to see my hands flying left and right and see all the bracelets? I think when I recorded, I had different bracelets on, but it's fun. It's hilarious, right? My favorite one on the two tire one, I actually showed you. Um, how to give it of that problem. I cracked myself up. I do that all the time. So listen, this ebook or audiobook or video, the combo of it all is really the thing that you have been looking for. I'm so excited for you. I am so excited for you. This is the thing that you have been looking for. If you are a serious writer, this is what you have been looking for. You don't have to wait anymore. It is here to stay, and it is that thing, literally that thing, that is going to help you finish your pro your projects, okay? You don't have to struggle anymore. These 10 things that have been getting in the way for the longest time, they have their num their days and their, and their hours counted. It's about to get obliterated. I mean, serious business. Are you with me? Check it out. Don't make any, don't think about it. You know that you need it. Just grab it. Grab it in the best way that works for you. If you want to do it, the ebook, it's not long. It's not going to take you forever to, to read it. I make sure that it was easy. That's why it's called the 10 easiest way, the quickest ways to obliterate it. So it's not going to take long. But if you just want to get into it quickly and you just want to listen to me, um, I, I promise that I did not speak as fast as I'm speaking now. I, I, I timed myself. I took deep breaths so you can understand what I'm saying. So you can get the audiobook if you want to watch me because I think I'm hilarious for, you know, in a good way or in a bad way, that's okay. And you want to watch the video, you might as well just get that, okay? But if you feel that you want to be all up in this thing and get saturated with the content, get the audiobook. Get the video, get the audiobook. It there's a way of getting the entire package. So you can consume it in any which way and then have it handy. You can print the ebook. You can listen to the audio when you're working out or when you're walking. Uh, and you can watch the video when you just want you wanna laugh and you wanna learn at the same time, right? <laughs> <laughs> what you see is what you get. The way that I that I read the book and I present it, it's the same way that I have shown up here. And it comes from a place of being there, done that, got the hat, the t-shirt, not the flip-flops, but some really cute sandals too. Um, and I don't want that for you. I don't want you, not that I don't want you to have cute sandals, but I don't want you to struggle. I want you to get off the struggle boss. I want you to be able to write and for things to flow and for the world to read the amazing stories inside of you. You have gone through some things. You done been through some things. Now it's time, my friend, my beloved, for you to not be in that place anymore. For you to be able to just write and not have to struggle and cry and, and eat lots of food because you are stressed out, okay? You can actually keep your nice figure, man or woman, it works either way, and write your content. Just write your content, no more crying, no more, no more struggling, no more writing the struggle boss anymore. You can actually write, okay, when you want to when you want to. I mean, that will just change your life, right? It changed my life. What, how? Well, three years later, I have 15 plus books. Who knew? I wait 20 years without being able to write, finish a single book, and then once I finish the first one, I learn how to get rid of writer's block 15 books later and counting. Maybe by the time you're watching this, I already wrote another one. That's how I flow. That's how it goes. So don't think about it. Run, don't walk, run to get your laptop um, in your computer, your computer, your wallet, and get a copy of writer's block Learn the 10 quickest ways to obliterate it. I'm telling you, it's going to change your life. It's going to make it so much easier for you to write. And you'll be able to very quickly be able to hold in your hands one of your books. I mean, the fact that I can hold my books and it's book after book after book and they are changing people's lives left and right. It's really amazing. And to be able to see your name in print right there it's just awesome it's so awesome to be able to see your name right there it's just um, it makes my heart um, happy and I want the same for you I really really do so grab a copy of the writer's block um, and get your writing on 
All right. Have an awesome day. Thank you for watching. Yes, I have all this energy all the time. Can you believe it? And I don't even get tired. Well, by the end of the day, I get really tired, like really tired. <laughs> Thank you for watching and I cannot wait to hear how much you love the writer's block. Learn the 10 quickest ways to obliterate it. Have an awesome day.